Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel, this is RevPGs. Today we are filming part 2 of our Fairy Fencer F Let's Play. Uh, before we do start off the video, I would like to say I am sorry for the weird upload schedule I've been sick for the past two days. I don't know if I'll, up I'll be uploading this video today or tomorrow, but you'll know whenever this video is uploaded. We've already posted part 1 to this Let's Play, as you can probably tell by me saying part 2, but whatever. Uh, if you want to watch part one, it's in a playlist with this, so I'll leave that in the link in the description and you can watch it from there at any time. But yeah, I hope you enjoy. Let's get into it. We're gonna visit Tomoe's shop first. Welcome, we have the latest, all the latest for your adventure needs, whether it's medicine, armor, or clothing. We stock it all. Our prices can't be beaten. If you've gotten items that you don't need anymore, we'll even buy those off of you too. Okay, so your typical RPG, RPG shop. Hopefully, we don't get. Too many tutorials are annoying. Now we're going to the pub. Welcome. Oh, you must be the new fencer. Adventures of all the types visit this pub, so you might even learn some useful information for your travels. There might even be able to. <laughs> there might even be something I can assist you with, so please speak to us freely. What do you. What do you fight on? What do you live for? Oh, what? Uh, I'm not doing that accent, bro. Huh. I never thought about, thought, think about that kind of crap. I just feel like doing what I want to do. I understand you act all tough, but you're old, old and on too deep, too deep sh 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 shorrow. I don't like. Oh, he's drunk. That's why he's speaking like that. Man, you, yeah, you must be wasted, huh? Quit cling to me. It's annoying. Hey kid, you have having fun drinking? I'm not a kid, the name's Fang, I'm a handsome guy, or so I'm told. <laughs> Alright, you may seem insufferable if you didn't watch the previous episode. Laughter. <laughs> Did you really just say that about yourself? You're an interesting guy. Fountain Plaza. World map. Right. Alright, Erin, I know how a world map works, alright? I've played RPGs before, believe it or not. Huh. Didn't know there were cards in this game. I'm guessing you equip them and they, like, dictate whatever power you use. Alright, we're gonna go straight here. Also, Soul Plane, isn't that a Neptunia? I don't like the Neptunia games though, they're, they're for Kumas. And I'm not one of those. Thank God. So this is the Soul Plains. Yeah, I swear this is in every hey, other fucking combat game. Why don't we set up game. Quits for today? I have played Neptune on this channel before, but... Tired. They're not very enjoyable games. I'll regret, but regret uh, buying them. Come on, let's go. All right. Fine, fine. Yeah, a bit needy, isn't she? Aaron, I don't need another one of your fucking tutorials. Okay, so that was actually useful. So if we destroy different parts, we get more XP and gold. Yes. It's done. Get ready! 
Alright, uh, this should be relatively uh, easy. Stay down. That was nothing. A new power. Nice, we leveled up. Oh, your HP actually goes up by quite a bit, so do your strength, intelligence goes up quite a bit, agility, luck, uh, SP, so spell points, vitality. Don't know what men means. Well, I know what a man is, but don't know what it means in this context. Tech. So those are technique points, right? Meningitis, maybe? I don't know. Alright, that's easy. Executing shooting. How did that not hit both of them? Come on, bro. Next. Easy. Alright, there's some loot over here. Let's kill this guy first though. Oh come on. Hit me again, I dare you. Can keep going. Thank you. Next. Easy. Stay down. They don't do much damage, luckily. Herb sprout. Interesting. Alright, let's just keep heading in this direction. The only um, compile heart games I like uh, this one, Dragon Star, Burn Era, whatever it's called, and then Death End Request. I don't like the first death run the last so I found it boring. Get ready. I like me some dark indie RPGs, you know. Especially when they're turn based. Let's do this. Stay down. Get out of here. I'm getting a load of challenges done. Alright, that's just keep adding in this direction. I need to remember how to use the map. Alright, here we go. Alright, so we've almost cleared the first floor. Burn toast? Why is that in the cosmetic thing? Uh, or is it? Uh... I mean... Yeah, yeah, that's better. Don't need that. <laughs> oh, it's a cos it is a cosmetic then. That's interesting. At least there's a lot of free cosmetics in this game, Let's and you don't have to pay for them like most compile art games. Next. This combat system's a bit too easy, maybe. Yes! Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> Let's do this. Like, I could just keep doing this for now. I'm pretty sure, yeah, that's just gonna one shot them. Alright, we might change the difficulty to hard. We'll do our first boss battle, which I think should be within the next two areas, maybe. And then we'll see how it goes. And if we struggle on that boss battle, we won't change it. But if we don't whatsoever, then we will change the difficulty. Alright. Let's do this. We should probably attack this one first. Yeah, yeah. Get ready. Because now we can do this. And yeah. Yeah. Stay down. That was nothing. Right, I don't really see anything worth looking at in this area, so we'll do this event. Huh? Is that it? That oh. thing launched over there. Already? That has to be the Fury. Jeez, Seems you're working me to way the too bone. early. Let's just hurry up and pull it out so we can get out of here already. That's what she said. What? You there? I don't anything. Just a moment, please. Whenever you hear this voice actor, you know the character's going to be down bad. Huh? Oh, it's her. Well, yeah, lunch, okay. Traveler. You seem quite fatigued. Don't know what you're talking oh, uh, about. No, not not really. Yeah, exactly, no, bro. No, no. I'm sure you must be exhausted. If you would, please, have a taste of this delicious tea. It's quite effective. You know, at least they haven't given her the fake-ass British accent like you do in every single fucking anime ever where there's a blonde-haired character that transfers into a school. She's always French or British. 
and the accents are terrible. Alright, if you're watching this, any anyone who, who does like the cast and choices for anime, get actual French or British people that speak whatever language it is for the dub, okay? Because I hate hearing Americans put on the fakest fucking British accent ever. It's an insult. It's so bad. Like, if they could do a good British accent that sounds natural, that's completely fine, but if it's anything like... Uh, Infinite Stratos or any 2013 anime, I'm done with it. I hate it so much. It's aggravating. Oh, that doesn't sound half bad. I Sorry for that admit, little ram. I was starting to get a little thirsty. See, this is Chang's hey, uh, type of person. Don't you think this is like super suspicious? No, she's definitely not gonna drug us or Did anything. Your parents teach you not to take things from strangers. No, why would they? Hey. Didn't you hear a word I said? Well, if it doesn't kill me, then it will make me stronger, you know? My, my I know body. that's not the way you say move. it, but whatever. Yeah, she's drugged us up, hasn't she? Jeez, Fang, you moron! I told you this was suspicious! Who the hell are you? Oh my, what? <laughs> not one word of gratitude after I just served you some delicious tea? How rude. Well, it matters what not. Do you want about? My name is Tiara. And this is my fairy partner, Kyui. It's a weird name. Never make that noise in my ears ever again about her. You still have much to learn about being a fencer if you fell for such a cliche trick. I don't care, I was just, you know, testing it. Oh, I was drug testing it. You have a lesson, yes? As a token of your gratitude, I shall accept this fury on your behalf. Fuck you. Hold on! That's just downright dirty! I agree, ma'am. Surely you just... For I am squeaky clean. Now then, drink. Now I'm good. What the heck is it? More poison? It's the antidote. No, it? it's an antidote. I cannot yeah. bear the thought of leaving you in this state. What a kind per. Why does she not like Black Swan? What a kind person. She just drugged us and gave us the antidote. See, guys, this, this is the type of kindness you need to see in the world. If you consume this, you'll be able to move. It reminds you of a Darman life, life lesson. During those five minutes, I shall take my leave of you. I thought you were being kind for a second, but you're really just a low-down, dirty trickster. The only oh, dirty thing here is your face. Your fairy friend has quite a shameful face, too. Hmm. I suppose you two are meant I to I thought be. I was gonna like this character, but I don't. What? What did you say? Yeah, fucking slap her, Erin. Tell me about it. She's got a really foul mouth, too. <laughs> oh my. It seems we're getting along rather swimmingly. Now's not the time for you two to get along. What? You're right. Hey, you stuck up bitch. You've got damn. a rotten attitude. You better watch I your mean, back agreed, from but now damn, on. that's some strong language. It's not as if I called two women a bitch in my last Shabney video. But we'll just ignore that. How can you say something so dreadful? You just drugged us. <laughs> Oh but no, I told reason, you she would be like this. I am getting rather excited. I knew she would be down bad. What the fuck, bro? What's wrong with this chick? I don't know, man. Now that I have the item I was after, I shall take my leave of you. Good day. Leave forever. Uh, hey, wait, hold on. Bang, get it together. We need to go after her. I was just drugged, you know. I'm still paralyzed. I can't move. <laughs> Wait, I'm fine now. Okay. Makes sense. Alright, we got some more enemies to kill. Ready? Get ready. Uh can I not fairize yet? Do I have to build up like a gorge or something? Alright, let's wait here. At least I can get both, yeah, nice. Next. Easy. Sorry. You're all gonna Let's die. This. Let's hope he doesn't hit me. Never mind. Let's do this. If only you could hit both at the Stay same down. time. With bad normal attack. Stay down. Get out of here. 
I do think the cool part about Compart games is the uh, knockback system. You don't really get many games that have a knockback system in turn-based games, other than the Trail series. Let's do this. All right, I ran out, ran out of SP. Uh, there you go. Just better kill someone. Oh, okay. <laughs> Never mind. Get ready. Huh. Alright, I should probably heal my SP and everything. Because I'm assuming we're going to fight that whatever her name was, Skurv. Alright. Let's use an item. Uh, easy. Alright, as long as we're not in range of this guy, we can now do that and one shot them. Easy. Alright, what's in the next area? We got an event there. Of course, I got some enemies here. Wait. Well, no, this is where. Okay. I was going the wrong way. Or hopefully both of you can... Okay, let's hit the start. Nice. Why can't he hit them outside of the ring? So annoying. Sorry, we're low on health. Well, I have music change when we're low on health. Not yet. Next. Nice, we got the perfect amount of uh, HP to now get up all of our HP and all of our SP. Gotta be a chest. Mid potion. So is it like a medium potion or is it mid? Alright, let's go up to this event. Don't really care too much about these enemies. Nice. Oh, proper animation. Oh my, who are you? <laughs> I'm a low level hoodlum. It's customary to encounter someone like me at this point. Now shut up and hand over that fury! How droll. I have nothing to give to someone as boring and uninspired as you. <laughs> then I guess I gotta use force to claim my prize. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, snag you while I'm at it, too. Of course, you have a little rapey guy. <laughs> I can't wait to see that cute face of yours after it's soaked with tears. I wanna see that, too. Fucking Reddit mod. Hey, Fang, you should probably choose your words more carefully. Huh? Who the hell are you guys? I don't know, the Power Rangers? Oh my. The Avengers? So you decided to pursue me, Fang, was and it? I assume you're one of the sex offenders. I understand. You've come to shower me with love. <laughs> you don't certainly me are an adorable boy. Don't call me that. That's not why. You? Yeah, we don't really are care. Are you this woman's ally? No. Nope. <laughs> yes, that is correct. This what? is my loyal servant. I knew you would call me that. Oh, Fang, right, no this bitch. bothersome rogue is attempting to force himself upon me. Could you be a deer and assist me? Oh, you could deal with him easily. Who the heck is gonna help you? Destroy him again. <laughs> so you're also a fencer, huh? Good timing. Hand over your fury, too. No, I'm good. Aw, uh, crap. Damn. I guess I've got no choice now. Oh, kill way. this bastard. Let's do this. Alright, let's start it off with a fireball to get that AoE in. Not AoE, um, burn effect. Okay, looks like there's no burn effect. Uh, let's use you. Easy. Next. Yeah, we're definitely have to chase the difficulty to hard. I'm even stronger now. You are quite strong. Thanks, I guess. What hole did you crawl out of anyway? Give us back our fury! <laughs> Your mom's. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm afraid I can't do that. 
Why not? However, I will give you something much more wonderful than any fury. She's gonna do something I don't like. What? Is it meat? Tell me it's meat. <laughs> so furies mean less to you than meat? Maybe. <laughs> it's even better than meat. What? I shall let both of you become my servants. How does that sound? No, Isn't I'm this good. wonderful? This makes you happy, right? No, it makes me miserable. Huh? I'd feel much safer traveling with skilled individuals like yourselves. When a helpless, beautiful maiden such as myself you. travels alone, I am often accosted by all sorts of brigands. Cool. Why, you selfish little... Why should we team up with you in the first place? I don't know, oh man. My. I agree with this you, This would man. be beneficial for you, too, as well. Having more people in your party during combat is advantageous, right? Additionally, Possibly, a I relative guess, of but... mine manages a nearby inn, so I can also provide you with a place Wait, to rest for the night. Give me a break! Why should we travel with an underhanded, conniving, two-faced? Does that inn have tasty food? Oh, Jesus, man. Certainly. I heard that they acquired a chef from a five-star restaurant. I wonder who that's gonna All be. Right. Let's team up. You're just saying that for the food, aren't you? Yep, that's an obvious answer to your question, but whatever. Oh, no, that's not the only reason. She's right. Battles will be way easier if there's three of us. It'll that's be a good easier point, to collect but she hasn't shown us her power yet. You better not make her collect the furies while you slack off. Anyway, take me to that inn of yours. I want to know what five-star food tastes like. Probably like shit. Yes, please follow me. It's probably like a tiny bit of butter with a little leaf on top and a fish eyeball next to it. Hey, wait a sec! Hey! That's the ear abuse. God damn it. Alright, yeah, I was hoping for more party members, not her, though. Ew. Get that shit away from me. I don't need, need to be told- oh, okay, actually, enough mud. There's a Fury's menu. Ah. These are pretty much light cones, like in HSR. Wait, so you can only operate one at a time. You can't just switch during battle. Meanwhile, oh, we're gonna see the big bird go or something. I don't care what happens to me. Just spare my grandchild's life, please. And what would we do there? Grandpa! Shut up! If you keep blabbing, I'll kill you with one blow. Okay, so copy and paste. Bandit guy, guy again. Save yourselves. Oh, here Hurry he is up again. Fork over all your stuff. Leave that kid with us too. Here he is again, but Don't with a different worry. hairstyle We're not and haircut. Kill her. Wait, is that Kirito? Weird. We'll make sure we get a good price for her after we've had some fun with her first. Why are you all rapists? <sighs> Weirdo. Oh! Yes. Pardon me, you seem to be in some trouble. Oh god damn it, it's a pretty boy. Ew. Huh? You're... I could tell he's gonna be like the proper like full of himself kind. Who the hell are you? Where do you come from? Why are you here? What would you like to know about me? Nothing. My name? My way of life? Or perhaps my prowess with the sword? Neither. I mean, they deserve to die, so, you know. My name is Sherman Shallancer. Sherman Not that my name should matter to a dead man. <laughs> oh, yeah, I see what you did with the Lancer in his name. Sherman, enemy force has received okay, I like this guy now. That is kind of cool. What's going on here? My loyal minions, they're... Why, you... I won't forgive this! I see. Ooh, don't care. You wish to follow them into the afterlife. This will not be pleasant for you. 
Yeah, I know. I, sh I, I kind of assumed if you get killed by someone, it's not going to be nice. Ryushin, release your full power and prepare for assembly. Ryushin, oh my god. Negative. Enemy strength inadequate to warrant assembly. I see what they did there with Our the whole henchin thing. Your current power level is 100%. He does look like a Gundam as well. I prefer to hold nothing back when facing my enemies. Like from the but actual case, Gundam TV I'll make an series. Exception. You bastard! I don't know what the hell you're talking about, but no one makes a fool out of me. I'll cut you to pieces. Cool. Yeah, maybe you should have shut your mouth, but whatever. Your prognosis was correct, Ryushin. Now then, are you injured, sir? I'm fine. Thank you very much for saving us. You're welcome now. Give me all your money. Thank you, mister. I don't you like that girl. had to be done. I delivered swift justice to those who had fallen into the ways of evil. Uh-huh. What, what in the world? What? Okay. Wow! How pretty! Cool. I bid you safe travels. <laughs> Have a wonderful day. So he's another fencer. Now then. Let's go, Ryushin. Oh, that means he's probably going to be on our team or our enemy. Who knows? An angel. I doubt it. I think he's probably You're an right. asshole. How fortunate, truly. He seems a bit fake to me, mate. All right, I'm guessing some of these areas are a bit too hard for us at the minute. The Sunflower Inn, okay. Here we are, the Sunflower Inn. That was a loud door. First we should try the five star food, next we'll try some more five star food, then we'll eat even more five star food. And finally we'll wrap up the day by eating the rest of the five star food. <laughs> you. So where is this five star food anyway? Welcome, I've been expecting you. Please take good care of us. Who's this old lady? This is the manager of the inn and my relative. She'll be cooking up for us. This old lady is the five star chef. She doesn't look the part. Do not worry, her skill in the kitchen is on par with any five star chef. You fraud. You totally lied to me. <laughs> Alright, fine. I think you may be a bit too rude, to be honest, sometimes. Maybe. Her cousin's wife's eldest brother's friend is a five-star chef, which means by the transitive tr property that she is one too. What? What does that have to do with cooking? You know what society calls someone like her? A stranger. You got it? Hey kid, you really don't believe that I'm a five-star chef, do you? Well, my last name happens to be five-star, which means I really am a five-star chef. What? That's terrible. What kind of stupid joke is that exactly? It doesn't matter so long the food tastes good, right? Uh, if you nitpick the details, you end up uh, with severe out of feet's foot. What? Why? Yeah, what are you talking about? That's not even possible. What kind of logic is that? Oh my, you have our feet's foot, young man? That's gross, Fang. You better not walk around this place with your bare feet. What? <laughs> That's absolutely positively not true, my feet are 100% fungus free. Stop your complaining and let us hurry along to the room. There are some things we I would like to discuss. I'll give you some medicine that will clear up your athlete's foot in no time, hope that clears you, cheers you up. Okay. Like I said, I don't have freaking athlete's foot. Talk to Eren first. I'm glad we found a place to stay, but I'm still pretty mad at Tiara. Me too. She lo totally lied about this place having a five-star chef. You're still going on about that? Well, that was some great dialogue. <laughs> what did you want to talk about? Can you close your eyes for a bit? Sure, I guess, but seriously, what's going on? You will know soon enough, but for now, please close your eyes. Oh god, it's not going to be a kiss, is it? I'm closing the game if it is, it's cringe, bro. Eren, you too. I know. Now then. What? 
Okay, good, good. Oh, yeah, do not open your eyes. Hey. Okay, you can open them now. What the hell? What? What the fuck? Where are we? <laughs> uh, what the shit? Okay, this is kind of cool, I can't lie. I don't know what any of it means. I think that's the goddess and the demon, or whatever it was. Or the foul one, was it? I don't know. What the? Where are we? Silence. What's the giant woman doing here? Oh wait, that's a statue. The goddess? Uh, so you notice the specter of a fairy, uh, but what passes a fairy, that is. I'm not going to dignify that remark with response. What is this place and how did we end up here? This is a dimension that exists only between the bound theories of la uh, reality in layman's terms. It's similar to dreamwalking. To a waking dream what? Okay. This is my no. QE's special power. Shut up. I see, that's an amazing ability. So we're not in reality right now? Gotcha. That's pretty mysterious. Long ago, the goddess was sealed in this space, and over here you can see the vile god. Yeah, it was the vile god then. That's right, the vile god, a malevolent entity who attempted to destroy the world a long time ago. As you can see, he is currently sealed by the sword stabbed into his body. Interesting. You're right, I could de uh, detect a faint flicker from his magical en energy. He's not dead then. Same goes for the goddess too. Ah, uh, now that I'm seeing this up close, what are these sword things meant to be? They're furies. Yeah, I thought so. But the power of the fury, if there is residing in them, has diminished over time. This music's pretty good. Oh, you're right, those are furies. Not every fury hit their mark though. The ones that, have, have, that had missed eventually made their own uh, their way back to the human world. I can't read this dialogue with this music going on in my ears. <laughs> so those furies and their fairies end up like me. And I don't really get it. What's up with this place anyway? Using the fury we attained earlier, we can remove the sword that established the goddess. Are you saying you're going to remove the goddess's seal? Precisely. Alright, we're about to wrap things up. I'm going to wish for all the tasty food I can stomach. She's not going to receive just by removing one or two swords. More importantly, what did you mean by using the fury? We must transfer the fairy residing in this fury. <laughs> That's such a confusing sentence. To one of the dominant furies, activate it and then put it out. And that will revive the goddess. No, there is something else we need to do in addition to that, but I do not exactly know what it is. I do not know what the most important part is. And how do you even know about any of this in the first place? Even I didn't know about this place. The fencer must dedicate themselves about the goddess and the bow god. It is far stranger than you that you two know any don't know anything about this at all. Besides, the only reason we are able to visit the this place is because of Kui. Of course, if it weren't you weren't missing your memories, you would already know of this, right? This must be embarrassing for you, what a bitch. I can't think of a response. Hey Fang, don't just stand there, say something. And so basically we gotta collect furies so we can revive the fairies inside of them and release a seal. Okay. So original gold has not changed, then who cares anyway, right? Oh yes, uh, also if you attempt to remove the sword, something will attack you, so be, please be careful. What do you mean, something? It's probably some kind of defense mechanism that protects the seal. Yeah, I gathered that. That's right, it can be quite difficult to handle. Please be careful when you pull out the swords. So you've already tried to do that. Well, it seems furies ha that have bonded to a fencer can't be used. Perhaps that's because the pact they formed is still in effect. You sound like you've experienced this before. I feel like it should be voiced. I really do feel like this whole thing should be voiced, but I guess not. This better not be a trap. I would do no such thing. 
You think I've forgotten about that tea stunt you pulled? Such details are irrelevant. <laughs> the three of us are all trying to revive the goddess, correct? Then it's settled. We will collect the furies and break the goddess to seal, understood? I wish we knew some other way to do this. We just gotta roll with it, I guess. Shut up. Okay. Alright, we don't really care what this is at the minute. I'm guessing we have an option of what ones we can seal. Unseal, sorry. Wait, we could unseal that. Jesus, that's terrible. Okay, so. Wait, please, it is dangerous to get close to the Vile God. Let us put out one of the Goddess's swords. Okay, I won't do that again, man. <laughs> uh, okay, let's release this one. So which one? Okay, we we'll use a silk one. Are you ready? Battle start. Okay, so we can actually use both of them in battle. Nice. Damn, they do a lot of damage. They better not kill her. We literally just got her as a character. Uh, let's restore our HP. That fucking demon screams in my ear once more, I'm gonna kill it. Alright, let's hit him with this. This music's pretty good. Oh, that was way too easy. Alright, go on, hit us then. Yeah, we're changing the difficulty right after this battle. Easy. Did we need that angle? Seriously? We didn't need that angle, did we? Alright, let's unseal this shit. Okay. <laughs> Bad. Felt like it dragged on for way too long. So I'm guessing we could choose the uh, Vile God in our second playthrough or something. Wind Protection 1, Angel's Luck. Okay. Revival Rank Up. So what we could do, what can we do with this? Your revival rank is now C. Is that like the Adventurer's Guild in the other games they make? We can accept higher rewarding quests or something. And that thing came right at me. Well, it's not like I couldn't handle it. Shut up. <laughs> we actually defeated it and broke the seal. Look, we did it. Thank you so much. I was awfully honest here. It is the boss's responsibility to acknowledge their peon's hard work. That's all. Fuck you. What are you calling the peon? I got some choice words for you. They hold it. For some reason I can feel an incredible power coming from the sword I just pulled out. You're right. What's this? Perhaps it was infected by the goddess's divine power, though it is difficult to say so for sure. But it seems the resonance effect has become significantly stronger. Resonance effect, what's that? When two furies resonate and with each other, a mysterious power is exerted that's known as a resonance effect. A mysterious power, huh? Seriously, where did you learn all of this? Like I said, I've done my homework. The details really matter when we're getting close to, to reviving the goddess. That thing needs to shut up. I guess that's true, but... Who cares? Let's go home, I'm hungry. Same, bro. Good idea, let's go back and have ourselves a five-star meal. Don't remind me about that disappointing reveal. I'm sorry, I can't reveal the truth. What do you mean by that? Okay, so now we can equip these. They're pretty much light cones from Honkai Star Rail, as far as I can tell. Well, wow, that are in Honkai Star Rail, like similar to them. Okay. 
So basically they're just personas as well. Anything you need. Please let me know if there's anything you need at the end. I would have it provided to you no matter what it is. We need a real 5 star chef. Except that. <laughs> what useless dialogue. Before we end the video though, we're gonna quickly change the difficulty to hard. Uh, HP is up by 25%, additional item drops. Okay, we're now on hard mode. If it's too hard, we'll just change back. But I doubt it will be, because so far the game has been piss easy. You know, hopefully, once we get to the gameplay mo loop more, it'll be harder, but who knows. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope to see you in the next one. Uh, yeah, we'll probably doing it, be doing a stream sometime this week, maybe next week. So stay tuned for that.